Hi, today we'll learn how to check a uh, laptop motherboard short. If there is some short in the motherboard, we can learn some trick to measure or to find the short in motherboard. For example, if you find any kind of coil like this, this one and this one, and this one here, this one, and this one. These coils uh, represent a uh, voltage source. For example, we have in the laptop many voltage like uh, 5 volt, 3.3 volt, 18 volt, 12 volt, 1.8 volt for RAM, for processor, for other. So if we, we, we have some short in the motherboard we need to know where is the short in this motherboard how I can find the short what I do here I use the overmeter and I, I will try to measure between any coil of this and the ground on the ground so for example here it will give 2 volt 2 ohm Here, it will read about 960 ohm. So, if we find some reading like this, two ohm or one ohm, that means there is short in this circuit. So, what I do, I take out one side from this coil like this. And I will measure from this side with the ground. So if you see, there is no measuring. So from this part, there is no short. The short start from this part. From this part. Here I have this coil. Also, I measure between ground and this coil so what I the reading is about one and a half kilo so it's normally okay this one also 690 so it's okay for this this parts of PCB here I have this one this coil if I try to measure there is maybe it's read high value for me it's okay there is no short here from the other side I have this coil here 327 ohm that's okay here read 27 it's okay there is no short in this area so how you determine there is short in the circuit as I said if you find the value is about 0 or 0 like this or 1 ohm 2 ohm that's mean there is short in, in this circuit if you it's re if it's read about 15 ohm 10 ohm or more that's mean it depends on this area on the area you you are trying to test on the laptop motherboard so for example there is here capacitor also I try to measure from other side and other side if I find for example this capacitor read 55 ohm so it's okay here it's okay This is small trick to how to determine or find the find short a laptop motherboard. Thank you for your watching.